All right, looks like we're live. We are in the same place we left off. We got our OP, OP weapons and such. There's nothing that's gonna stop us from killing Ganon. Uh, that's just, I guess, as a summary. I have the Master Sword, I have the Hero Shield. I don't have anything particularly amazing when it comes to armor, but that shouldn't matter because we just won't die. Easy peasy. Our goal is to get to the top, of course. And we're gonna do this probably in the most uh, direct route possible. I don't know if there's a way that I can avoid too many enemies, but I will try and see what I can do. Rivali's Gale is now ready. This seems pretty direct. Looks like the audio is fine. I have my headphones on right now. Cool. Alright. Now we run. <laughs> There's also a, uh, a storm outside, so it's like almost kind of thematic that it's raining right now. <laughs> Where are we right now? We're currently circling our way around. If we keep going this path, we won't make it there. I could just, I could just gale. That's no fun. I'm going through here. Pretty sure I've already been through here. Yeah, yeah, this is just this way. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll walk back through again. Basically going back the way we were. I think we killed pretty much everybody who was here. So get us up higher as well, without costing too much. Ouch! From downtown. See how you like it, friend. I'm a better shot than you. <laughs> Got him. Uh. Yeah, he's probably got shock arrows. I'll take it. Nope, no shock. Interesting. How about our bows? How bad are we? We're fine. Meals. We are very low on meals, honestly. I'll go with this for now. Oh, a chest. Okay, let's just use Gale to get up, rather than climb this whole thing. Oh god, the shaky cam. Yeah, we already, we've already been through here. Should have killed everyone on our way through. And then this way goes down to the armory. There's like a laser post to the right, but we already killed him. Yep. I remember this. I've been through here way too many times to forget everything. <laughs> okay. It's not the right way. That's the right way. There we go. Oh. That's a lot of dudes. Not dealing with that. Alright. That was a pretty safe route, I'd say. being a safe route. Who's looking at me right now? 
This guy. I could probably bow him down from here. There's more than one. Let's get that guy over there too. If we go all the way to the left, we won't get shot. Nope. Still more. <laughs> could gale. Probably would have to gale from here. That looks promising. Well, <laughs> get out of here. Should have a high enough, nope, not even close to high enough swim speed, okay. Alright, looks like we're here. I'm gonna have to run past these guys. There's too many. Ouch. Run! <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, We do not have that many arrows. Okay. That is four and a half exactly. Okay. Alright, this is a very long cutscene. I won't speak. Definitely pretty scary. <laughs> One of the more grotesque versions of Ganon. Now my moment has finally come. Brace yourself, Ganon, for the sting of my revenge. This will be our final opportunity. We will not fail. Spoilers, he's not dead. <laughs> he's at half HP, exactly. Wowie.
backing off, I see. Well, just doing that circling game. When are you gonna do something? There we go. Come on, jump you fool. Jump you fool. There we go. Jeez. Okay, we're probably going to need to switch bows. That is okay. sure what that was. Oh. Well. Ouch. That hurts. <laughs> well, I tried deflecting this. Oh uh, no, this is this is not that. Fun with that. Apparently, it is not working that same fashion. You can tell just how many times I've actually gotten him to this point without cheesing the crap out of him. Typically, I cheese the crap out of him. <laughs> or trying to do this a little bit more legit. Come on, hit me. There you go. Do it again. There you go. You can either do the counter hit or you can do the uh, abilities from the guardians and have that work. Just normal text, don't worry. that too. It's not too hard to dodge though. They give you a lot of breathing room. And that's actually the harder part of the fight. The second half is even easier. Again, a big push over this game. It's kind of sad. But he's honestly kind of a pushover in every game. I'm trying to think of this ever a version of Ganon that is not a pushover that I've faced personally. I know like Wind Waker Ganon and Twilight Princess Ganon are pretty good, but I haven't played against either of them, so I wouldn't know. Demise is super cheesable. What's up? <laughs> okay. Tornado warnings, yeah.
Ganon was born out of a dark past. He is a pure embodiment of the ancient evil that is reborn time and time again. He has given up on reincarnation and assumed his pure, enraged form. If set free upon our world, the destruction will be unlike anything ever seen before. Sorry, I had a coworker call me. Lottie is currently trapped in St. Louis and can't make it. <laughs> so that will probably cause problems for production tomorrow, but what are you gonna do? For those bung points, lady. Yep, and I'm killing my horse. Get out of there. That was my chance, but we're messing it up. <laughs> there it is. Wait, we're on the wrong boat. Alright, we're not that bad. Even with the longest time period possible, we still got it in time. <laughs> I don't know if we still have fairies, so I'm gonna heal. It's a weird pet with that particular bow. Two arm below, and then the third, the fourth one is a surprise. <laughs> well, that's a foot. It's a very dangerous laser if we can move it any quicker. Quicker quicker <laughs> than he is right now. trick to this is you have to use the blast that he does to jump up through the wind current and then shoot it or else he doesn't let you do it so you gotta wait for this to happen all right <laughs> the wood all right that's it even basically AFK, we managed to do it. <laughs> I will try not to say too much. Thought it is a lot of cutscenes. <laughs>
I would say that's pretty OP. <laughs> Why couldn't she do that before? <laughs> Keeping watch over you all this time. I've witnessed your struggles to return to us, as well as your trials in battle. I always thought, no, I always believed that you would find a way to defeat Ganon. I never lost faith in you over these many years. Thank you, Lin. The hero of Hyrule. May I ask, do you really remember me? Maybe. <laughs> At least a little bit. All right, these credits, are they skippable? Oh, I could skip them. I think I will skip them, at least after a little bit. You can get a taste if you want to see the rest of the credits. You can watch them online somewhere. But spending stream time to watch the entire credit seems a little lame. <laughs> It's just a recap of all the themes. Okay. So we skip. We can go to the post credit scene if we have any. We might not have any. No, we have we have at least one. Oh no, we don't even get that. Okay, fine. Sometimes you get like them watching over you before you leave. Well that's it. <laughs> that's all of Ganon. So what do we do for the rest of the hour of the stream? I don't know. But we're gonna probably wing it. I have to get out of here first. We have one gal that can use it to get off the ledge. And what I would like to do is I'd like to see Satori at least once. I just don't know if there's any way I can guarantee the trigger. Can't warp until we're outside of Hyrule Castle's domain area. Because the map is constricted to just the castle itself. But once I get here, yeah, okay. Um, I guess we'll go to Kakariku. And then if we see a bloopy, I believe that is the trigger that the mountain is active. If we don't, then we're out of luck. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So where is it? It is... Right on the blue. Can we see it? No. I was curious if that was an indicator. Oh, nope. Nope, that's, that's just the beam. Not our beam. We're looking for a greenish haze kind of thing on top of the mountain. Well, in that case, I can do some of the cooler shrines. Mazes take a little while. I don't really want to do that. Oh, let's do this one. This one's fun. It's the closest one. Looks like this is the only way we got there.
Yeah, Shrine's fun. Okay. So we are going towards the red. I'm just going to text the toy again. Be right there. Nope. Not active. Okay. <laughs> that is quite the, the distance to get all the way over there. That's not even the right shrine. <laughs> I guess we'll get that one first, just because it's on the way. And then we'll go to the shrine in that particular spot. We're gonna need that. Because we do not have the stamina. Yeah, there's no way. We don't even have the flight time. the storm <laughs> if I suddenly disappear it was the storm mm. what's that that is Elizabeth that's awkward how can we deal with this not well, I would assume. Maybe you won't see me. No, he saw me. Okay, buddy. That's one way to kill, I suppose. I guess we'll get his stuff. <laughs> Basically, no way I could miss that because of, you know, electricity and whatnot. These seagulls are after me right now. <laughs> I don't know what I did to deserve a seagull stalking, but they are definitely not leaving right now. Or is it all a ruse? What is this? You're lying to me, game. There's no seagulls anywhere. They're all the way over there. Maybe that's just how sunlight works, I don't know. Seems kinda weird. The shadows are way too big. Shrine nearby, say it ain't so. Respect this. The eyeball. It's always a little weird. I guess since this is a casual stream. Uh, other than the fact that I have been on SEPTA like every day for like the past few days to get to and from work, um, work has been relatively normal. I've been doing about the same thing every day, which has been nice. It's nice to have at least the same material to come back to so you don't get like too confused by what exactly you have to do every day 
Because sometimes you'll have like... <laughs> Like six different products they're working at once at my work. And I'll be like, what am I even doing? I feel like that's more of like a, a quality control thing. At least where we are. Oh, okay. I could probably swim that. Yeah, it's fine. That's a very generous marker. Yeah. Alright, now I actually do the shrine. But this is not the shrine I was looking for. The actual shrine I'm looking for is over there. Yeah, you can hear that, that thunder and lightning. Well, you can hear that thunder, you can't see the lightning. Probably don't want to use the Master Sword. Probably. You need that for a quest, so I guess we're using this. It's actually almost too good. Most I have is the free stuff. So I'll take one of these, I guess. Mate. Okay. Guess we're using this. I don't have any ancient bows. I do have an ancient shield. I guess we'll use the last of this. Probably won't need arrows, but we'll see. Triple weapon. Okay. Mm, pretty good so far. Doing those little spangy thing. Or is this? This is the other one. Okay. cancels though. We're getting them. <laughs> Alright, he's done. There you go. That was direct. We have become adept at the game, or at the very least, our weapons are pretty good. Nice. You can hear that rain. It's also a tornado warning tonight, so if like I never stream again, I might be dead. There is a chance.
I know there's a chest in the back here. I'm gonna get that. And then we'll see about this whole Lizifo situation we apparently seem to have. We needed those, that's good. Wonder what would happen if you went to- well, I won't spoil it. I'll get there first. I'm thinking of a scenario that is interesting, but it would spoil what would happen when we get there. Which I don't want to do. I know. Ouch. Stray failed. Saw that though. Interesting. How many wood weapons do we have? Basically two? If I didn't have to keep the bliss route, I'd get rid of it to get that, but we do. No skeleton ambushes out here. <laughs> into this guy. Or sword him. Depending on how close he'll let me get. Oh, he's already dead. I guess that's that. <laughs> yeah, that rain is getting kind of scary right now with all that thunder. I don't think I'll stop the stream early unless it looks really bad. If I start healing like, or if I start hearing like heavy winds, like really heavy winds, I might like go for shelter and stuff. But at the moment, we're at wait and see territory. Fish. I'm not gonna delay stream for fish. <laughs> Unless it literally walks into my lap <laughs> like that. Accidental fishing. There's two more Lizaphos out here, my god. When will it end? I guess this is the uh, punishment for not doing it. The uh, the high flying way. I'm like, where's the bow? Um, this should be fun. Alright. Electricity sure does make ocean battles easy. <laughs> Almost there. I wonder why they made it swim speed for this instead of like, I don't know, like the damage from the spin attack. Because the swimming does seem pretty irrelevant when you have something like this. Maybe if they made it so like you could only use cryostasis on non-sea water, but that'd be pretty limiting. And they don't limit. Mm. This game. Ever. Okay, here we go.
One of the difficult challenges, probably the most difficult challenge in the entire game. That's kind of neat. Oh, it's not already equipped. Okay. Um, no actual arrows, though, which is kind of a thing. Tree branch. Not really an upgrade. Somehow I need to get a ball over here. Any kind of, like, fruit and vegetable is worth something. Do we do we still we do still have bombs, but that's pretty OP. <laughs> well, guess I need to like light something on fire. I guess that's helpful. Need to find the orbs though. Chest? Yeah, it's a chest. They should have negated the runes, honestly. But I guess it would have been pretty hard if they just got rid of everything you had. Arrows, that's very helpful. Still looking for some orbs. Got a rock. <laughs> yeah, bomb cycling is just so strong. <laughs> so much for resourcefulness. Did not think there will be a hole inside the tree. That is awkward. Also, looks like we've triggered our fiery friend over here. I wonder how much the rain's gonna be in this recording. Because it's definitely pretty heavy. Okay. Oh, there's an orb. You have to take out in this entire encampment of dudes. And there goes one. Yoink, mine now. Because the main problem is we still have to de defeat our friend down here. I want to make this on fire to have a better shot at killing him. Come on. What are you doing? Easy peasy. Alright. So we have the ball. But we don't have any way to actually get the ball anywhere. From what I can tell. There's also a fireplace here somehow. I must have 
relit itself because the day cycle changed or something. That makes some sense. Oh, that's not what I was hoping to see. Holy crap. <laughs> that was a big explosion. Okay. Well, there's nothing out here for me to put this in. So I gotta go find this elsewhere. I know there's the one down there where we started. It'd probably be a better idea to find one closer. So I don't carry this around everywhere. Nope. Let's try and not wake that. I assume there's one at the top. No, there it goes. A very hard mountain to climb. Don't wake up. Okay. I see you up there. I see you and your shenanigans trying to make me fall down with your electricity. I ain't having it. Going this way this time. And there it goes. Well, this seems hard. Actually, like 100% certain there's something up there. Kind of remember from last time. Just not quite sure how we're supposed to get up there with this ball. No. Oh, that's bad. I guess we're doing this now. We have a pretty reasonable bow. We're probably gonna have to kill them. many arrows so I should be focusing using those to actually knock him down. He has a pretty good weapon on his neck there. Let's try and get that off of him. Ah, near impossible, huh? Is that cheating? Probably. <laughs> Look at that face. How can you say no to that face? <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't really call that resourcefulness. I would call that having OP reserves. <laughs> got two of the three balls. I'm very certain there is something up there. I'm gonna try again. Dang it, man. There's gotta be a way. Maybe there's one up there. That would be helpful. A 
have no actual arrows. It's kind of a problem. the old-fashioned way. Alright, good enough. <laughs> So yes, there was a ball already up here. That makes complete sense. So now we have all the balls. I know two of the holes. There may be another hole up there that would be kind of mean. I need a Noctarok. I don't think I have any. No. Also kind of need more food. Oh, suspicious as heck. Save us some climbing time. <laughs> Seems to be where the shrine is at the end. And sorry, but we're gonna have to kill you. Alright. We got food. Where was this pot? Was there no pot? There's the pot. Alright, so... Get one of these. That did not work the way I intended it to do. But we can work with this. Okay, good enough. Still need an Octorok. So I gotta find one. Not sure what this is actually for. Seems kinda weird. There's our two orbs. There's another hole for the orb. Over here. We'll take care of these now while we look for our truck. Hmm. Come back. How do we do this? This little spot here looks traversable or not. Let's try and get up there, scout the area first before we do it like last time. Ah, there's a spot on the right. Okay. 
Oh god. Technology was stronger. <laughs> Good try, game, but I am too smart for you. Some durians over here. Don't really need more food, though. Just need to bring the ball over to the sun. Then go hunting for that Octorok again. Well, that's that's pretty much it as far as like as far as like uh, the challenge goes. I believe the actual shrine that you get from the end of all this is just you did it. Congratulations! Instead of. Uh, actual shrine. But I might be wrong. Pretty sure that's the case, though. Alright, here's one. There's another one on the other side, which we'll need cryostasis to get this to. This also, I think, goes past Dr. Ark territory, so we'll be able to get something on our way around. Alright. There he is. Hey, buddy. I need that. Gimme, gimme. Right, the one balloon should be enough, from what I remember. But since we're here, get this ball where it needs to go. I believe you have to use cryostasis to get this to work. So I never intended to balance this around you having the runes, but the runes are so OP. Probably need to put it in the water first. Why is it lightning now? I think the bow is still bad. Yeah. You have to nudge this now. <laughs> Alright, that should work. just have the one on top. <laughs> I think when I first tried this, it was raining like the entire time, which kind of sucked. <laughs> I think I had to use Gale to even get anywhere.
don't know why I'm gathering bananas. Whoa. Really, buddy? I didn't even see the chest. You can't do that to me. Imagine me getting struck by lightning here and then dying. Let's not do that. Alright, now we have three balloons. There's no way we get this wrong. It's freaking scary, man. Freaking scary, man. <laughs> there's the orb and there's the slot. Just need to get the orb closer before we do this. to me. There you go. It's gonna break the balloons and then fall on my head. Watch it. It's gonna do it. stuff back. Thank you very much. wonder what happens if you actually didn't have any stuff to begin with. <laughs> that was what I was thinking on the way here. It's like, do you get to keep the stuff? Be kind of nice. Urbosa's fury is ready. <laughs> okay. So yeah, it is a little hard, but not too hard, I'd say. Definitely, I think the hardest shrine though. It's a lot to expect someone to just be able to do something like that if they don't have like all of the Divine Beast stuff or not, or uh, at all, rather. Nice. Okay. So I'll check for Satori again, I guess. I unfortunately cannot stream past the hour because my ride is stuck in St. Louis, as I mentioned earlier. <laughs> Makes it kind of difficult to get to work. <laughs> Means I'll have to take Septa again. Uh, let's try here. I should be able to see from here. Could get the Great Fairies active. It's not particularly interesting. Could do the mazes, but we already did one, so that's not particularly interesting either. Could help this guy. Where's our thing? It's apparently this way. I don't see the, the marker though. There it is. Okay. Much more direct than I thought. Yeah. <laughs> Far 
farthest destination possible, eh? I feel like it'd be best to get some height first, but it looks like I can't climb on that, so... Go down the middle. Goal is distance. We could do this, friend. Essentially, we try to get our stamina gauge to be fully empty. <laughs> this ravine is pretty deep, so looks like it's the best way to do that. Getting close. I wonder if it counts if you manage to uh, grab onto something. You won't be able to. That's all I got. Do I get a prize? Black screen of death? No, here we go. Wow, a whole net gain of one. Thank you. <laughs> I'm good. Check Satori again. Okay. One day he'll be back. Pretty sure we've seen it. At least once on stream. The glow that I'm talking about. Right now I seem like kind of a madman even saying like, It exists, dang it. It exists. But it really does exist. You just shoot this orb and it goes in. Seems easy enough. Oh, yeah. Nothing but that. Badoosh. Okay, where is the chest? Is it above us? It must be. Okay, I see the chest. It's up there. Pretty sneaky. Not bad. Oh. Have to put it down first, then put it back up, I guess. Is that it? Is that the whole test? You should be ashamed of yourself, that was easy. 
Alright. Easiest spirit orb ever. Not sure what else to talk about as far as this game goes. I guess my opinions of Breath of the Wild. I think it is a really, really, really good game. There are definitely some ways where it can be improved. Like, um, enemy variety definitely, I feel, is something that kind of lacks in this game. There's really only, like, three main enemies in the game. And then that's it. It's just Lizaphos, Bokoblins, Moblins. That's it. There's some boss enemies, but you really only run into them every once in a while. There's some, like, side enemies, like, uh... The Chew and the Bats. The Keys. But, they're so inconsequential that it, there's really nothing interesting about them. You just hit them once and they die. So, I feel like they made some more enemies that were... Interesting in the way that they interacted with you. That would be nice. But as far as like the world building goes, it's pretty good. The uh, the rewards for the quests can be lacking at times when it's just more gear. I feel like they should have a lot more stuff like the... Uh, not like necessarily the, uh, the clothing, but like the, uh, the dragon quest. That would have been cool. Just to have like a, a means to the shrine that actually feels like it's earned and then you get like some interesting reward at the end. Like, I don't know, like a spirit item. Kind of like you do with the, um, the heroes. Have something like whenever you're in the area of a dragon you gain an attack or something like that. That'd be cool. Just to make more unique items, I guess. Because you, have, all, you ha have like all this room for key items and then it's demoted like three for horses. Seems kind of weird. Like, stylizing your horse is fun, but... I feel like they could have consolidated the whole kit into just one slot instead of... putting everything into, uh... three slots. You know? Since I guess I'm not gonna be using this bow much anyway. Might as well use it for this now. Easy peasy. Just don't feel like going all the way over. <laughs> Alright. I've already been... Is there any place that I haven't been all that much? I guess we haven't been here, but this is essentially the same thing as every other icy area. So it's not that interesting. What other unique-ish areas are there? We've been down the shore. Let's see. Oh, I haven't I haven't seen the big horse yet. We should probably do that before this is all over. I believe that's around here. Yeah, because this is the grassland. I don't know if I have enough stamina gear for it, but I'll try. Well, at least get to see the horse. Alright. So we want to go here.
Pretty easy to get to. Yep, it's cold. We're cold. Now we're not. I could have definitely upgraded my gear more, <laughs> but we didn't need it, so I didn't want to grind it more than I had to. We already grinded for the Zor gear anyways, you know. Alright, there it is. There's our big horsey boy. Or girl. Whatever you choose. So we should climb a tree to get a better angle at it. And I'll fly down on top of it and get myself a horse. So if there's anything I remember about this horse, it is pretty perceptive. Can't quite see it though. I know it's like around below me. Put on the. Do I have stealth gear? No, I just have speed. Alright. Yellow then. Where's the horse? I don't see it. Oh, it's all the way over there, my gun. Okay. You've isolated yourself from the back. Womp womp. Alright. Actually kind of like this tree better. Hopefully he doesn't notice. It's closer. I see that Korok. I can't pay attention to it right now. Okay. Wow. Denied. Gotta really sneak up on it, I guess. Get it on the old-fashioned way. Quiet because I am method acting. <laughs> Let's get some of the stamina stuff used. Looks like OBS decided to kill itself. Should stop streaming. I can keep recording. If you're seeing the YouTube version of this, it should be completely uninhibited. If you're looking at the stream right now, I am starting. Looks like you can't go faster than that. Let me keep recording since it looks like we're going to be ending the stream anyway. Oh well, the internet just freaking died, huh? Killed a wolf, good job. Where's the nearest stable? It's a bit of a ways. It's over here. Gotta make it all the way. Don't chase me, bro.
trying to resolve my connectivity problems there and that while also riding a horse is not working out too well. <laughs> I will get this horse and then hopefully this issue will be resolved. Not super hopeful. At worst, I can just edit the two and render them together. This horse is being very unruly. Run, horse, run. Should be able to autopilot now. Yeah, the internet is freaking dead right now. I don't know what's going on. Might just be the weather. Why can't you use the path, buddy? You can't steer on your own? Tell me to reset my router. This looks like it might be the end. <laughs> Oof. Oh well, I'm sorry that the end of the stream was offline. Fortunately, it looks like nobody was currently watching at the time, so no one will actually be affected. But it's gonna be a dang shame if Satori is just here now, too. <laughs> just be like, surprise, I was here all along. You silly goose. My horse now. Alright. We'll name him Storm, I guess. Because that's what's happening right now. <laughs> Could name him Tornado, but I definitely don't want that to be happening right now. Ah. Okay. Ah. This is our new horse. Right, I'm going to pause this. And we'll see if we can actually get this started again. If not, this is it. Goodbye. See you with a new game for casual streaming at some point. Don't know.